Yo, what is good, YouTube? Sosa here, and I'm back with another banger for y'all today. Before we get into the video, I just want to thank y'all so much. We hit 20k. I don't think y'all heard me. 20k. Y'all know how crazy that is? I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. I love every single one of y'all. Everyone that's part of the Sosa gang, you know, I appreciate y'all and I love y'all. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a like and a comment and don't forget to sub. It helps me out way more than you think. And it's just me, everything to me. But today, I got y'all with another banger, you feel me? Like, today, I got y'all with the advanced dribble tutorial for 2K24. This works on both current gen and next gen, by the way. But I'm gonna be doing it on next gen. Let me pop up the controller cam for y'all real quick, you feel me? The first thing you wanna do is just go to any, nah, 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 hold on, hold on. Before we go to the court, right? Before we go to the court. Let me show y'all my updated six, cause yes, I did change him again. But you gotta understand though, the, the game is, you know what I'm saying? The game is uh brand new, so we still getting used to it, so. But D6 right here, D6 is the one I'm re rocking right at the moment. I got pass style Trey Young, cause this is the fastest one in my opinion. Dribble style Kyrie Irving, signature size of Steve Francis. Regular breakdown combo Asaya Thomas, aggressive breakdown combo LeBron James. Escape moves Trey Young, combo moves Stephen Curry. Crossover Jason Tatum, behind the back Stephen Curry, spin move is John Morant, hesitation is Chris Paul, step back is Stephen Curry, and these don't really matter, you feel me? But like, alright, so let's go, let's go into this this court real quick. You can pick any court, just any court where you can dribble, you feel me? I just like going in here because I don't know, there ain't no bars, you can just dribble however you want to in here. Uh, this dribble tutorial though, it's not a beginner dribble tutorial. This is for my advanced people out there. I've already dropped the beginner dribble tutorial. And this is, I'm gonna I'm put it up here in the top right corner right now. So if you're still a beginner and you don't know how to move, like you don't know the basic moves, like how to do the curry slide, how to do the speed boost, how to do the momentum, go to the beginner video and watch that first. That one's gonna help you out a lot. And then you can come back to this video after. All right, so the first move I got for y'all is gonna be this one right here. Y'all see this one? It's so simple. All you do, you hold turbo and you flick down on your right stick. So like, let's say you combo now, boom, boom, boom. This is nice, like you create a little separation. Speed boost out of it, go that way, that way. Feel me? It's a move you, you must have in the bag right now. Next move is the momentum. And the way you do this is the ball is in. Whatever hand it is, you wanna hold turbo, balls in your left hand, you wanna flick your right stick diagonal up right, so up here, and the left stick follows through the same the same place. But the, it's very important that the right stick goes first. So you get that right there. Ball is in your right hand, you hold turbo, and you flick your right stick diagonal up left, and you follow through with the left stick. The good thing about momentum is you can put everything into it. So let's say your momentum, speed boost. Feel me? Momentum, snatch back. Mm think momentum curry slide momentum behind the back see what i'm saying like you need the momentum to, to combo up momentum is what makes your combos look glitchy next move i'm finna teach y'all is gonna be the little step back right here see that one right there it might not look effective at all when you just do it like that. But the thing about it is like you can spam it like that. This is gonna make your defender look a little confused, feel me? The way you do this is say the ball is in your left hand. You wanna hold turbo, flick your right stick, a little bit diagonal up. You see right, right there? And you wanna flick down on the left stick after. So the right stick goes diagonal up first and the left stick after. See? Ball is in your right hand, your whole turbo, flick your right stick, diagonal up left, but not fully diagonal up, but like a little bit more than sideways, and down on the left stick. Then you just spam it like this. Hold on. Let me go all the way up here.
And then I had people asking me how I get the fast stop and go. So like this one right here. Cause they're saying with the Kyrie Irving dribble style, they get this one. That's not as fast, you can still use it. But this one is faster, you feel me? I'm teaching you how to do it. What you need for this, this is the Chris Paul hesitation. And basically all you do is you do hesitation to the side, which is holding turbo and flick your right stick to the same side as the ball is in. So the ball is in your left hand, you flick your right stick left to the side. You get this, let's say the ball is in your right hand, you flick it right to the side, you get this. So all you wanna do is when you stand still, you flick it and you wanna cancel the animation out by running. So you just flick it real quick. See what I'm saying? And it's also just good to have this move in your bag, like for your combos. This is nice, like you're comboing up a little bit of that. Now let me teach y'all how to peek on this game. Cause if we all know, you can quick stop just by standing still and shooting, right? But you can do it way faster if you learn how to peek it. I ain't gonna lie, I forgot to explain how you actually do it. So I'm gonna explain that right now. So speed boost and then tap L2 and shoot. Or hold L2 for like a split second and then just shoot off it. It's gonna cancel out the L2 animation and it's gonna give you a quick stop. Let me show y'all this one more time. Y'all see that? It's instant. Crazy. Oh. You see that? Oh my God, the peak is crazy. And then out of the speed boost, I ain't gonna lie, I feel like when I do it, out of the Steve Francis like this one, it gave me a lot of fades when I do it. But when I do it out of the Trey Young speed boost, so you know like that one, like the one uh, where you hold turbo on your speed boost, it's just way more consistent. It's like it don't really fade off it. And it's good because you remember this one I told you before? You can do it out of that, see? Straight peek that. All right, so the next move, it's pretty simple. It's the step back, but with the Steph Curry step back, like it's just a nice little separation you can get with it. You can go over here, you can do it behind the back out of it. You know what I'm saying? It's a little 21 vibes, ain't gonna lie. So yeah, you wanna make sure you have everything that I taught you today in this. I'm not done though, I'm not done though, don't worry. We're not done. I'm just saying like these, these are the things you wanna have down. These were the most important steps. The way you do this is you literally just run to the side and flick down on your right stick. If you run straight, you're gonna get that one. If you run to the side, you get that one. All right, then we got the explosive behind the back. It's that one. You get some different animations this year. It's not always the same animation. You can get that one, you can get that one. You see? But the way you do this is the ball is in your right hand, yeah? You hold turbo. And you can flick your right stick diagonal down left, so down here, and the left stick goes diagonal up left, so up here. See that? Ball is in your left hand. Let's do the same thing, but just opposite. So the ball is in your left hand, the right stick goes diagonal down right, and the left stick goes diagonal up right. Just like that. Alright, so this next move I love doing is kind of a combo, I guess you can say that. But you do a Trey Young crap. And then you do a Chris Paul hesitation, and you do a Trey Young speed boost. See what I'm saying? Like, it's just nice. Because if people start to catch on to it, you know what I'm saying? You can always go out of the, that one, you feel me? Like, the reason I like this is because there's a good counter to it. Like, you can go out of, you can speed boost this way. You see what I'm saying? Like, you can go that way with it. Or you can go that way with it, so you gotta keep the defender guessing. Now, let me show y'all how to L2 cancel in 24. I know y'all remember the L2 cancel from 23. Y'all saw that? So the way you do the L2 cancel is you speed boost to one side and you want to hold turbo, not, I mean uh, L2, and you want to speed boost back to the other side and let go. 
And you can do that. The L2 it cancels out the animation, yeah. The L2 cancels out the animation. So that's why it's nice. Like you can do this with a lot of moves too. Let's say I'm going this way, right? See the curse light with it. It's so broken, I promise you it's so broken. Oh my god. The L2 cancel gotta be the best move in the game. You just gotta learn how to do the timing. All you really do, you speed boost one side, hold L2, and let go and do the, another animation. Like you can do it with so many moves. Like look, you see that right there? Normally you would get that, but if you do it with L2, you can get that. I remember on 23, one of my favorite moves, it was like L2 stopped like that. Can you? Yeah, you can still do it on this game too. I just figured that out. I ain't gonna lie. It's my first time trying it. Hold on, let me see if I can get used, used to it. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Yeah, I gotta level up with that one though. But you know what I'm saying? Like, the L2 cancel, you can put it into so many moves. That's why I like that move. Alright, that's the end of the video today. I appreciate everybody who made it to the end of the video. If you made it to the end, comment social games so I can see who stayed and who didn't. If this video get a thousand likes, it will drop a combo tutorial. So you can really learn how to combo up like me. But I feel like that's just part three. So now I got y'all with the beginner moves to advanced moves. And now we're waiting for the combo tutorial. You feel me? But again, thank y'all so much for 20k and I appreciate y'all for making it to the end of the video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a like and a comment and don't forget to sub. It don't cost you none and it helps me out way more than you can even imagine. So again, appreciate everybody for watching. Let me know what y'all want to see in the comments and let me know what y'all want to see for the 20k special. Because I hit 20k so I promised the 20k special. So let me know what y'all want to see for it. Because I, I, to be honest, I don't know what to do for 20k special. But, ain't no more to say. So's out.